More than a year into Russia's war in Ukraine, the conflict remains a major source of uncertainty for the Caucasus in Central Asia. On the heels of a strong recovery from the pandemic, growth in the CCA in 2022 was supported by a milder than expected contraction of the Russian economy and high oil prices in oil exporting countries, and increased transit trade and large inflows of income, capital and migrants from Russia in oil importing countries. However, as the impact of some of these spillovers fades, we expect GDP growth to slow from 4.8% in 2022 to 4.2% in 2023. Inflation is projected to fall, provided monetary policy is adequately tight and global commodity prices ease, but to remain generally in the double digits this year. The war's short-term spillovers carry risks going forward, a reversal of inflows, worse than projected growth in Russia, lower oil prices, supply chain disruptions, or lower remittances could imply a negative shock to CCA economies down the road. On the upside, inflows that have supported growth could prove resilient, and changing regional trade patterns, including renewed efforts to diversify trade routes, may present opportunities. Policymakers will need to calibrate the policy mix to reduce inflation without causing a significant slowdown and continue building fiscal buffers, while ensuring that any additional fiscal support reaches the most vulnerable. We recommend that CCA countries actively foster private sector development by reducing the state footprint in the economy and strengthening the business climate, reduce trade restrictions while pursuing diversification of trade partners and routes, decarbonize while ensuring energy security, and address governance challenges to ensure a better and more inclusive future for all.